intermittent fasting for health benefits, for weight loss, for anti-aging and for multiple other benefits. Fasting is trending these days and unfortunately a lot of people that try fasting fail before even succeeding. What's going on? So in this short video I want to talk about the misconceptions that are holding you back from reaping maximum benefits from your fasting protocol. But before we do that, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, I would request you to go and sign up and click on the bell icon so that every time we have a video for you, it pops up on your screen. So let's get back to the topic. Three big misconceptions. Concept, misconception number one, calorie restriction. We have understood that we have to do dieting in fasting. A lot of people still tend to think that calorie restriction is part of intermittent fasting. Nothing could be further from the truth because the one thing that you are doing is you're not restricting calories, you are restricting the frequency or the number of meals. So you have a fasting window and then you have an eating window. So your eating window is that you have to eat as much as your body requirement hai. so that what happens is in your fasting window, you, you operate in what we call low insulin states. Jaise aapki fasting window on hoegi, or if you've been watching the kind of food you eat and if you've been following other guidelines, then your body starts operating in low insulin states and that's where your metabolism starts to tap into body fat as a fuel source. So please understand that uh, calorie restriction is not a part of intermittent fasting if done the right way. Misconception number two. People tend to think that kisi kisim ka bhi khana khaa lein because humne fasting to karni hai, humne bohut sare ghante jo hai, humne kuch nahi khana, to anything will do. And again, nothing could be further from the truth because agar aapki khane ki quality low hoegi, inferior hoegi, if you're munching on junk food, if you're munching on on low grade carbohydrates, if you're having lots of white flour, then there's, there's a chance that in your fasting window, you may not be able to sustain that fast for a longer period of time. You see, fasting in there, hamara ek aur bhi goal hota hai, jiske in hum inflammation ko kam karte hai, hum gut health ko improve karte hai, hum liver health ko improve karte hai, hum uh, apne jo hormones hai, unko balance mein leke aate hai. So, if you are operating if you're doing the fasting protocol and your food quality is not right, then there's a chance that you will not succeed. Now, what, what do I mean by food quality? I'm talking about adding adequate amounts of good quality fats, olive oil, desi ghee, butter, uh, when we talk about carbohydrates, fruits, uh, when we talk about other forms of carbohydrates, why not go, uh, instead of white flour, why not go into a whole wheat flour if you don't have problem with gluten or if you have problem with gluten then you might want to go gluten free. So as you can see that the, your food quality is improving and that is going to help your fasting window and your overall uh, benefits that you're trying to achieve from fasting. Misconception number three, fasting window. A lot of people again tend to think that the longer your fasting window the better it is. So a lot of people have been jumping on the 16 to 8 protocol which is 16 hours of fasting and 8 hours of eating window. And people have even gone to OMAD which is one meal a day. Jiska matlab kya ki aap din mein ek meal le rahe Which is not the right approach. You see, you have to first see which uh, format works for you. It, and it could be something as basic as a 12-12 format which means that ki fasting or 12 ki eating window. Or it could be 14-10, which means 14 hours of fasting and 10 hours of the eating window. So you have to see which window works for you. In, uh, and you have to be, you have to become very intuitive. That you have to see that in that window, 
जो आपने प्रोटोकॉल लिए है वट एवर फास्टिंग प्रोटोकॉल दैट यू हैव अगर वो फोर्टीन uh, टेन भी है if it is working for you if your energy is on point if you're not getting fatigue or lethargy if your cravings are low if your brain fog is gone then maybe that is the format for you zaruri nahi hai ki jitni fasting window lambi hogi utna benefit milega ek baat iske andar ye dusri baat ye hai the right way to fast where you really get benefits and you can sustain it is when you gradually increase your fasting window so literally your first step towards fasting could be that first i'm going to start by cutting out the snacks so i'm going to have three meals and there's going to be no snacks in between so call it a mini fast that could be your first step the second step could be that once you've achieved the first phase successfully moving on to the next phase could be a 12 12 format theek okay? hai which is which also called a beginner format uske baad aap 14 10 kar sakte hain so gradually giving a few weeks in each um, format and then moving forward and what are the what are the key signs that you want to look into ke agar aapki energy lethargy mood swings cravings and all of the stuff the if the, it is on point if it is positive then you can be sure that you can move to the next phase or the next format so as you can see these basic but very common uh, misconceptions have been holding you back so i hope this video has served you like i said please uh, go to my youtube uh, youtube channel cl click on the bell icon so i can deliver more quality content to your phone or your doorstep thank you